Hey everyone, I'm going to show you this a first review of the Tiny brand and it is the BMW i3 Metropolitan Police uh, in London. So I've seen this car in London when I visit and I wanted this for a while. This was delayed for so long but now I finally have it. I think that's even the Mercedes Sprinter van that I couldn't even get my hands on because it's still waiting for release or whatever. So to get this finally is great. So let's see if it meets the expectations I've had after waiting for so long. So just a quick look at the packaging. Boom, social media links, tiny Hong Kong. So it's an official licensed product, which is good. Number 15, UK flag. There we go. So. Uh, I think this is a 1 to 64 scale. Let's get this all open. So it's for 14 and over, um, like a collector's model rather than a toy. Oh, I've got a bit of plastic there. Oh, look at that. It comes in a little bag. And there's just some plastic stuff down there. Okay, let's get that off to the side. So we've got this tiny branded bag right here with our logo. Let's get this all open. Hopefully it's not going to be too sticky. There we go. Okay. Whoop. Here we go. So this, already I can see the cool fluorescent yellow paint. This is Met Police BMW i3. It's got a num number plate. Painted lights, got the chevrons here, CHQ, there you go, so I just lost admiring in that, lots of, de lots of detail here, but I think there's a tiny scuff there, let me just zoom in even more, is that a scuff mark, possibly, no it's not, it says something three, okay, I think it's a, that was so tiny, I thought it was like a, a defect, but <laughs> no, it wasn't. Okay, fine. So, um, let me just zoom out slightly, so we can get the whole vehicle. There we go. So, got the accuracy of the tyres as well, really good. You can see my finger through here and here. So, maybe they could have put the base up a bit higher. Had a more snug fit, or they could have put some plastic in under. Anyway, that is the view from the side. Let's have a look at the front. Yes, straight on. Looking brilliant. Lots of details. This is definitely worth the wait. I love well painted models like this one. Really cool. Got that light blue highlight there. And. So yeah, they've just painted that line so just to follow the design. Now this is cool. Opening doors. Shame there's no opening boot, but you know, for what we've got, this is brilliant. So here we go. Let's zoom in more. Look at that on the inside. This is some random piece of dust there. Okay. So look on this side. Okay, so it's a right hand drive. Sorry, I'm just used to looking at left-hand drives because a lot of the cars I get are American. Um, yeah, so that's that. On the top, there are siren lights right there. You know, I, don't, I haven't even rated any of my cars so far since I've been doing these videos. But this one, you know, it's a solid 8, I'd say, at least. Uh, lots and lots of details, really cool. Now, let's see about functionality. Very smooth, brilliant, great stuff. It looks like the real thing as well. So it's got both the looks, it's got the sturdy manufacturing. And yeah, this is a, a very impressive die-cast car. Okay, let's give this guy a spin. 
You know, it's so tempting to buy like four or five of these and just set up a diorama scene. Really cool. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll give it a spin first and I'll whack the doors open. So yeah, um, it's a bit, I think I've lost a bit too far out. There we go. There we go, guys. Check that out right there. One day I'll get this camera sorted and it'll be on a level plane so I can rotate it a lot better. Um, but for now, I think you can appreciate all the cool details this vehicle has right here. Okay, let's get these doors open and you can see what it's like. By the way, really smooth doors. You know, some major models I have, some Matchbox models I have. They're not that great. Some Siku models I have. That is slick. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant piece of die cast. So yeah, uh, I look forward to getting some more tiny cars in the future and showing, showing you what they're like. So yeah, let me know what you think of this video. Drop a comment below, give it a like and subscribe for more reviews.